What's up y'all? So today is my birthday and I am feeling myself, okay? And this is going to be my video on my curly to straight natural hair routine. As you can see, I got some inches. <laughs> Nah, but um, stay tuned and I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how I achieved this look um, and how I got my hair nice and smooth and silky and straight without causing any heat damage and keeping my hair nice and protected. So, stay tuned. Alright, so I'm about to start my detangling process. I just washed and deep conditioned my hair. So I'm going to go ahead and um, detangle my hair, part it in four different sections, um, detangle it, and then I'll go ahead and get ready to start the blow drying process. Alright y'all, so don't mind me because I was really feeling myself. It was my birthday and I was dancing to music that you just cannot hear, so... <laughs> Yep, just don't mind me. I mean, you can mind me if you want to, but I was really feeling myself. I was jamming, and you can tell me shit, okay? So, yeah. Um, before blow drying, I always go in and I spray my hair with a thermal um, quick drying protecting spray. Um, it basically protects from heat damage for up to, I want to say 450 degrees. Um, let me look at it really quick so I can let you guys know what all is in it. But it's by the OGX and it has um, hydrolyzed silk and quinoa in it. Yeah, and it cuts the blow time in half. Um, notice that hair. whenever I, I am blow drying my hair, I like to so point the make sure you guys have downward, a um, um, heat protectant on your hair before you blow dry it or put it in all over well. the place and I don't have control over my hair um, whenever I'm <clears throat> blow drying it. And then I use a round brush because that just helps me get the ends really good um, and keep control of my hair, which is like the most important thing while you're blow drying it, just so you can have a smooth finish.
all right so now i'm about to go ahead and section my hair off um and then i'm going to begin the straightening process um i usually put my flat iron at about i'd say 375 degrees that's what gets my hair straight and then i go ahead and use a brush um for the chasing method just because it smooths my hair out and smooths my ends out especially and then um, I'm gonna do that process throughout my whole um, flat iron routine so you'll see that as the video continues um, also don't mind me I was doing a lot of things in this video I'm on FaceTime with somebody I'm texting probably gonna dance again but you know what don't act like you don't be in the zone when you're doing your hair <laughs>
as you can see I'm doing one um, long pass through each section that I do um, it's really important to not like constantly go over your hair so you want to just take your time going through each section it doesn't really seem like I'm taking my time because I fast forwarded a video but that was just because this video would have been extremely long if I didn't but um, yeah just take your time do one pass um, because as you know time goes on sometimes you touch your hair up and you don't want to just keep constantly applying heat to the same area of hair that's how you get heat damage so yeah Alright, so I'm going to go through um, and get my edges. Um, I'm going to go all over um, and bump my ends just a little bit. Well, not necessarily. Well, yeah, bump them, I guess. I'm just trying to keep them from being straight and straggly and give my hair a smooth look and a clean finish. Um, and then I'm going to add some edge control to my edges. Um, so that I can control like the flyaways and my edges are stay in place and um, then my hair will be finished and I'll have the final result.
Yeah, don't mind me again. I stole this dude's hat that he is not getting back. So I just had to let him know he wasn't getting it back. <laughs> but um, as you can see, I have about armpit length hair. My goal isn't quite um, waist length, but it's just, I'd say mid back, um, definitely past bra strap. So yeah, you'll be able to see. I'm going to give you a quick turn around here in a moment. so that is my curly to straight hair routine i hope you guys got some tips there um that can help you guys in the future with your curly to straight hair routine and i am feeling myself <laughs> hope you enjoyed it <laughs>